All right, so we'll start with luminosity. Greg, how did you feel about the major? In what way? <sighs> Do you feel like you guys underachieved, overachieved, or just hit, hit it right at the sweet spot? Well, to be honest with you, I mean, it, it, it was an up and down event for us. I think that there was part of me that thought we underachieved because I didn't like the way we played against Complexity and Fury at all. And I think that had we had played a little bit more up to our part, like that we played on day two, we wouldn't have been in that position, but we put ourselves in the hole. And I was proud of the way we fought on day two. And I think we got to a certain standpoint where it was like when we were playing against Vitality, that that was the level that we needed to be at the entire time, but we weren't there the entire time. Um, I don't know if it was, I think it was a big combination of nerves and, you know, it being Cheese's first land. I could definitely see a lot of um, confidence issues he was having. And I think, but again, it was just mostly him trying to shoulder a ton of burden that he did not need to shoulder. Um, but then at once we got that like taken care of, cause it, it wasn't something that like, it, it didn't even feel like he was thinking about it until after I saw it, like when we were going into the Furia matchup that I saw it. Um, but then day two, like, you know, we addressed those issues and we came out and luckily we had a, a team, like we played limitless. So it was like this easy escalation of like limitless. <laughs> then we played OG and then we played vitality. So it was just like this nice escalation of, uh, skills where you get the land jitters out. Now you play a good team. Now you play Vitality. Right. Um, but as far as results, I mean, I think most people probably pegged us around where we finished. But for me, I wanted that top eight. I wanted to play in front of the crowd for sure. So underachieved, but I'm, I'm proud of the way that we bounced back on day two. You guys definitely did bounce back really well. I got to know, did you have just as epic of a speech as Sathu did on stage? Or what, what was it that got them to come back? It was a combination. I mean, like, there's a lot of stuff that we're doing behind the scenes that, like I said, like, it was a lot of nerves the first day where had no amount of speaking that I was going to be able to do was going to fix that. I think that it was, you know, the boot camp leading up to it was supposed to be, like, that huge lead up or, like, we're talking about mentality. And I was really trying to break it down to, like, there's no pressure on us. You don't have to worry because everybody thinks we're dog shit. Everybody thinks we're going to finish 14th. It's like it's going to be <laughs> APAC and then Luminosity. So <laughs> so it, I was just trying to alleviate that sense of like this is a big thing. Just go out there and play our games. And it, it seemed to be working a lot. And then once we started getting towards that stage is when I started seeing it like break down a little bit. But it was a lot of individual talks. Like the individual talks that we had and like going over replays like where it's like, hey, this is not us. Like, when we're looking at the Fury replays, I'm like, that doesn't even look like our like the way we play the game. So getting back to the basics of, all right, let's play our game. Don't worry about the outside noise. Don't worry about the land. You're just playing a game. You're having fun. And when we do that, we play our best game. So a lot of individual type talks, like, in, like weaved in there to help that. Makes sense. Yeah, I, I like, you definitely nailed it on that. Day one, I think everybody could see of, whoa, what's going on? But then day two, it was a, okay, they found it. Like, yep. we, we got it. There, we're, we're here. There, there is yeah, a Yeah, that's the boys we chance. know. We yep. did not predict you to not make it, by the way. No. We were like, they're making it. We know you. We know what you guys are made out of. We've seen it. And you'll get there. I know you will, man. Just yep. stay on that. Exactly what you said is going to keep climbing that mountain one, one rung at a time. That's all we could do. So, I mean, it's it's our first event, and it's our first event as a team. And I know, you know, for a lot of teams, it's the same way. Like, everybody's playing with their first iteration on the roster. But it was a big event because for Cheese, it was his first one. And, um, well, I'm just I'm just hoping to continue to build on it, where it's like, all right, that was the most pressure you're ever going to face, right? Now, right. you have to come back home, and now we, we have all the pressure. Like, you just play your game now, so... Um, is you just want to keep building like those building blocks throughout the season. And if that's a successful season in my books is if we can continue that, go to the next land and continue to build on it. So that's good. I, yeah, I, I think you guys definitely did. You hit the mark. There was a little bit of an underachievement. Sure. You didn't make the yeah. crowd, but you, I think you guys got as close as you guys got. Like it was, it was right there. So it was, it definitely felt like, okay, they did. They showed yeah. up. Um, and then we go to uh, a G2. And...